Yo. If you live in the mountains, um, one thing you should have is a generator. Um, I suggest you get that Predator 3600. It's a great generator. Um, I've owned them for about maybe about three years, and mine runs great. I'm about to change the oil on it. One thing about it is you got to keep the oil changed, break it in properly, and it's going to serve you well. The only major work that um, I've had to do on it is change the uh, spark plug and, you know, keep it clean. So to change the oil, it takes like a 10 millimeter <coughs> socket. Take the stick out first. Wow. Oil looks clean right there. Look real good. Wait a minute. If you take this, if it's leaning and you take the stick out, it's gonna start dripping. So take the screw out first. Cold outside is best, like you change the oil when it's warm, that way you'll get a, a full drip out, you know. Let that oil start dripping, take the stick out, clean the stick off. Whoa. Takes a 10W30, it's the type of oil it takes, and then I put in 400 ml whatever that ml thing is but uh that's what i replace it with that's the type of i still got 400 ml left of that one new so i'm going to uh yeah that's new oil i'm going to replace it with uh, 400 ml of that of that right there all right Wasted a little oil on the ground. Put that, work. Put that screw back in before you place the oil. One time I didn't tighten the screw tight enough and uh, I was running it and the screw fell out and the oil came out. And uh, the, the machine is stopped. You know, it can recognize when, like, uh, there's not enough oil in it. So it stopped. Another good thing about, I got mine from Harbor Freight. Uh, Harbor Freight is real good with the, uh, with the warranty. So I had a couple of problems with ones that I had brought previously. Took it back to Harbor Freight. They, uh, they gave me a new one immediately. No questions, no qualms, no problems. Whoa, brand new. They just gave me another generator. So. Shout out to Harbor Freight. All right, here goes the uh, 400 miller. That's what's in there, 400. 
that's what's left for my last one. It's about a half a pint. All right, and then we'll. There's another do ha ha that I had to uh, keep clean, and that's a spark arrestor. Um, you know, you don't you want to keep that spark arrestor clean. So, one time I had a problem when uh, my device was choking. You know, it wasn't really running clean. It was coughing, and uh, I just cleaned the spark arrestor, and whoosh, it was back running fabulously. So. That's the only couple of issues I've ever had with uh, with my machine. Like I said, you know, if you live in the mountains, it's always a good thing to have a uh, a generator. Then I take that the old oil and then I pour it into like a, a old container. You get me? And then that way, uh, when I take it back, I got a place I take it to. They just take it back. So, there's that. Tight. Oh. There we go. Oil change complete. There we go. See how it sounds. I already been running it. So I'm going to have to put it on a run. Yeah. There it goes. Sounds, sounds beautiful. Keep the stats on it, but... It's been running 438 hours. There it is, you can see. It's been running 438 hours. That's real good for a, a generator. Now I'm going to put a load on it so you can see how it sounds with a load. Purring like a kitty. It's all high. I'm never running with the, with the throttle save thing on there. So there it is. Uh, it's got a 9 amp load. So. If you live in the mountains, you should, you should have a generator. And my suggestion to you that Predator 3500. It's a champ. Add about the Predator is it runs real silently. Um, that's it. It's outside. You can barely hear it. It's like one wall away, and like you can you can barely hear it. If I go upstairs, I won't even notice it's running. That Predator is a it's a nice purchase. You won't uh, you won't be upset by it. All you have to do is make sure that you break it in properly and um, keep it maintained it'll serve you well uh, that's that predator 3500 uh, and i got mine from harbor freight i suggest harbor freight because they give you a no hassle trade-in if you have a problem